Hey, pretty girls, it's Taylor to Pretty Girls Club. If you're new, hit the subscribe button. If you're not, hey, girl, hey. As you can tell from this video, I'm going to walk you all through how to ship with Shopify. I, If I got a dollar for every time somebody asks me how to ship with Shopify, I will be a trillionaire, okay? I can't, I'm, I'll be a millionaire. So I'm going to walk you all through step by step on how I ship with Shopify. I even created a fake little order for you all so I can show you all my exact screen and walk y'all through. So if you want to learn how to ship with Shopify, go ahead and keep on watching. Okay, so the first things first, this is how Shopify will look when you pull up the screen. As you all can see, I have three people on my website right now. I made $70 today and I have the one order which I just made to fulfill. So you want to click one order to fulfill. So now it's going to show up all the orders you have to complete. Now, for example, if I had, if I was to basically ship all these, I would click this button. And as you all can see, all these are highlighted and I could just press create shipping labels. But because all of these are old orders, I am not going to do that. So again, I'm going to go to one order and I'm going to click it. As you all can see, now that I have it clicked, this is what it's going to look like. It's going to have the order number unfulfilled, meaning I have to pack it or print it. It's going to tell you that it's paid. And then this is where you're going to get the address from. Um, people always ask me, how do I know what people order? It's going to come up on the screen. As you all can see, I just put a custom item for $0. All this information is going to be on your screen for Shopify. Now, what you want to do is click this green button right here that says, and I love y'all because I'm going to pay for this out of my own pocket. Click on create shipping label. Now, right here is where you can edit your screen. So, for example, let's just say um, the customer item was, let's just say right now it says my, I have four ounces. Like I told y'all, I just automatically put my items at about four ounces because I sell bracelets. But let's just say if you sell hair and the box is three pounds. So you will type in three right here and you would change it to pounds. And as you all can see, oh, you would change it to pounds first and then you would type in three. And as you all can see, the price changed. But I want to take it back two ounces and then i'm going to change it to four ounces simply because that's how much bracelets usually weigh so right here you will see the different options that your customers or that you can choose i keep everything on first class package and sometimes my customers click priority i do not deal with usps because usps is just too expensive as you all can see just that one item will be seven dollars with ups and three dollars with usps so i just keep everything on this screen this is where you can choose if you want to ship with ups you would choose this but just know of course you have to change your shipping prices and things like that so you want to click on the first one and if you want so let's just say you are selling items that cost two or three hundred dollars if you want to you can click signature confirmation I don't, I've never done that. I might start doing it this year for um, Black Friday. I don't know. So this is where you're going to get your shipping label from. Now, all this is just a regular packaging. Don't like, so for this, I already just have this on default settings that it comes with on Shopify. You set that up when you create your Shopify store. And then you're going to just click the word right here, buy shipping label. And I'm spending $3.96 to show out this video. So this video better hit 10K. So now, this is another question. Everybody always asks me, Tay, how do you get your shipping label and package slip to print together? Do you see those words? Print with shipping label. Make sure you click that. Because if you don't click that, as you all can see, the shipping label is right there. And then the package slip is right there. It's going to print out one by one. If you want them to ship together, click print with shipping label all of this information is now going to be emailed to your customer automatically okay so then you're going to just press print documents it's going to come up on the screen like that and because um like i said this is a fake address everything like that you're going to just press print and because i'm using my mom bin, everything is already set up it's a four by six so now 
the shipping label is going to print out just like this. And now you have your shipping label for your customer, okay? So your customer can, um, your customer is going to have, this is going to go on a package and then this is going to go inside of your customer's order. Um, honestly, shipping with Shopify is not hard at all. So this video is obviously very, very quick. Um, but that is how you ship with Shopify. Again, it is very simple. It's very simple. Um, it's super, super easy. So that is literally how I ship with Shopify. Like, to be honest, I didn't really think that this video deserved, this concept deserved an actual video. But I guess you all really, really need it because people ask me this every day. How do I ship with Shopify? And it's literally a two, three, four step process. You just click the order, click the shipping service you want to use and click buy and click print. So it's super, super easy. Again, I've only used Shopify. I don't know how to use anything else. I've never used Wix, Big Cartel, anything like that. I've only used Shopify since my first day of business, which was in 2019. So I can only tell you about Shopify. Um, I do keep my weights at a preset because I do sell bracelets. Of course, if I sold anything heavy such as hair, lip gloss, lashes, shoes, of course, I have to weigh each item. But because I literally sell bracelets that's less than an ounce, I just keep the shipping weight at 4 ounces to 10 ounces. Um, but other than that, that is how I ship with Shopify. Um, it's super, super easy. Um, yeah, so that's all I have to say. So if you found this video helpful, leave me down some purple hearts, and I will see y'all later. Bye!